everybody, and welcome to Musion Battle 1000. I can't believe we have come this far. Bye, oh bye. Anyways, folks, I got a big random tag team characters gauntlet match for you all. So we're going to have mixed teams go at it. Ten of them. Anyways, here's random team number one. Let's find out who we get. Oh, we got Omega Zero teaming up with somebody. We'll find out who his partner is when the match begins. Anyways, random team number two. Let's see who we get. Oh, we got one of the Cyborg Ninjas. We'll have to find out who his partner is as the battle starts. Let's see. This fight will take place on the Universal Arena stage. Hope you guys enjoy. And let Fusion Battle number 1000 commence. Oh, Omega Zero and Blossom well, teaming up. Listen. Interesting. <laughs> and then we got Cyborg smoking Cracko. Hmm. This should be a very, very intriguing matchup. Let's see who wins. Alrighty, Blossom starts off with a freeze on Krakow as he gets knocked out of the air. Cyborg Smoke misses the teleporting uppercut. Blossom catches him with an uppercut of her own. Slide kick to an aerial uppercut on Cyborg Smoke. And then Krakow gets air slashed by uh, Omega Zero's Beam Saber. And then Cyborg Smoke gets knocked out of his teleporting uppercut. Krakow already grounded. Now Omega Zero carving into Cyborg Smoke as Blossom tags on a roundhouse. Good God. And Blossom and Omega Zero won that no problem. Alright, round two. Let's see who wins. Let's see if Krako and Cyborg Smoke... Oh, man, Cyborg Smoke smacks Blossom with a teleporting uppercut, but it goes right through Omega Zero as Blossom shoots out a freeze. And now Arctic Blade right to Krako into a freeze ball. Cyborg Smoke shoots out his harpoon, misses Omega Zero. Blossom charges up a giant eye beam hitting Krako nicely. And now Omega Zero does some sword uppercuts to uh, Cyborg Smoke in the corner. Blossom spamming some roundhouses on Krako. Krako takes to the air as Omega Zero summons some boulders. And then Blossom fires off a big eye beam taking Krako and Cyborg Smoke down. Damn, that was a crazy fight. Alrighty, it looks like Blossom and Omega Zero prevailed in the first mixed tag match. Another day saved. Better luck next time, sucker. <laughs> Alrighty, folks, looks like Blossom and Omega Zero advance to the next fight. Let's see if they can keep their momentum going strong. Alrighty. Let's see. Now for round two, we gotta get Blossom back. And we gotta get Omega Zero again. Let's see, where are you, Omega Zero? I gotta find him again. Aha, here he is. All right, Blossom and Omega Zero continue their rampage. Let's see what random team number three is going to be. They are going to fight. Let's see. Ooh, CM Punk we got in this match. But who's his partner? We'll find out in a moment. Anyways, this battle will take place on the... We're going to keep it at the Universal Arena stage. I like that wrestling level. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this fight. Here we go. Match two of ten. Ooh, CM Punk and Snake Eyes. Well, CM Punk's going to get a giant monster helping him out. All right, let's see how round one goes. <laughs> now let's see, Blossom starts roundhousing some demon cobras as Omega Zero does a beam sword uppercut. Blossom just dashing around, and then Blossom freezes up CM Punk. Omega Zero attacking CM Punk after he's frozen, and Snake Eyes already taken out by Omega Zero's projectiles, and the demon snakes get knocked away as Omega Zero gets a beam saber uppercut to CM Punk, and Blossom shooting off, shooting off hand beams, and already played a giant multi-hit boomerang bow. Now let's see, CM Punk gets tripped up on the ice puddle, and then Ice backfires. Omega Zero gets to CM Punk's grill, gets a big beam saber combo, and then Blossom gets a go to sleep from CM Punk, and then Omega Zero takes out CM Punk with a beam saber. Good God. A beam saber uppercut. Alright, let's see if CM Punk and Snake Eyes can make a comeback here. Or can Blossom and Omega Zero keep the momentum going? Blossom gets a slide kick to uppercut off on CM Punk, and Snake Eyes summoning more demon snakes as Blossom lands a super fist. Into an I beam cancel on CM Punk, doing some good damage to him and Snake Eyes. Omega Zero firing off blue energy sparks and sword beams, and then CM Punk gets grounded by an aerial by an aerial sword uppercut, and then Blossom finishes off CM Punk with a hyper beam. Good God, with like a giant I beam laser or whatever that was. Man, Blossom and Omega Zero are just tearing it up right now. What? Afraid of a little girl? <laughs> Looks like they are, Blossom. All right, folks, match two is over, and now Blossom and Omega Zero continue on their rampage. Now they must fight random team number four, and we'll find out who that is in a moment. All righty, folks, here we go, random team number four. And this team is going to be... Bomberman and, uh, and one of his partners. I don't know who his partner is, but we'll find out when this battle starts up. So here we go, Universal Arena. Match number three of ten, here we go. Oh, we got Homer and Bomberman. Okay, this should be an interesting contest. All right, Blossom starts off with a slide kick to an aerial uppercut on Homer. Let's see, Omega Zero firing off four blue energy shots and sword beams. 
And then Blossom does a multi giant multi-hit boomerang bow, knocking Homer and Bomberman down. Blossom sets up a nice puddle, then a hand beam. And then Homer just getting slashed in the corner as Blossom reels it in with an already played into a super fit. Omega Zero ra 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 raining down boulders and energy beams on poor Bomberman. And Bomberman taken out of the fight already as Homer gets knocked out of the air. Homer getting volleyed around by Omega Zero and Blossom. Let's see that Blossom tries to go in for a super fist or something. And then Omega Zero pounds on Homer with boulders and a sword uppercut and a giant multi-hit boomerang bow. Good god. Blossom, Blossom and Omega Zero is just dominating. Homer and Bomberman just don't have a chance here. All right, let's see Blossom freezes Homer as he tries to eat a sandwich. Omega Zero gets in with a sword uppercut. Then an ice puddle slide kick to an aerial uppercut on both Homer and Bomberman. Let's see Blossom tries to run a ground combo slide kick. And Omega Zero spamming boulders and beam saber uppercuts in the corner. Then a giant multi-hit boomerang bow trying to catch Homer as he gets up. Then an Arctic Blade right to Homer and Bomberman. Slide kick to a double aerial uppercut. And then Omega Zero attacks on a beam saber uppercut. Blossom taunting both opponents. Uh-oh. And now Blossom firing off a giant lightning bolt. And takes Homer out and Bomberman, I think. And Omega Zero finishes off Homer with a big blue energy beam attack. <laughs> Damn, man. This is just one crazy fight, man. Blossom and Omega Zero are just dominating still. Piece of cake. <laughs> it seems that way. Oh, sorry about that, folks. I was plucking out my text file there. Anyways, I'm just trying to see how many more fights we got here. Oh, uh, let's see. I gotta shrink this down more. Oh, uh, let's see. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, we got nine matches. All right, folks. Looks like Blossom and Omega Zero won match three. And now they go on to fight another random team. Oh, boy, oh, boy. This match is just getting more fun by the second. Alright, Blossom and Omega Zero continue on their rampage against another random team. Let's see who they will fight this time. Ooh, we got Diddy Kong and a partner that will soon find out who it is. Anyways, let's see. The battle will continue at Universal Arena. Hope you guys enjoy. Ooh, we got Diddy Kong and Sailor Chibi move. This should be interesting. Alright, let's see how Blossom and Omega Zero do against Chibi Moon and Diddy Kong. Alrighty, Blossom starts off in an ice puddle, tripping up both Chibi Moon and Diddy Kong, and Chibi Moon tries to fire off some pink hearts, and Omega Zero charging in with some sword uppercuts, and then Chibi Moon does a flipping somersault kick to Omega Zero, but it doesn't do much. Blossom setting up an ice puddle, now Chibi Moon and Diddy Kong just getting dominated in the corner by Omega Zero's light aura, and then Blossom tacks on a giant multi-hit boomerang bow, now Chibi Moon doing a massive flipping somersault kick, and then a, uh, a Luna P ball right into Blossom, Blossom trying to block the pink sugar hearts, and then Chibi Moon tries to pounce on Blossom. Blossom tries to fire back with a super fist. Ends up landing it on Diddy Kong. And now Chibi Moon summons Pegasus to charge into Omega Zero. But it goes right through him as Blossom finishes off Diddy Kong. Now Chibi Moon pounces on Omega Zero as Blossom does the nice uh, slide kick to Aerial Uppercut Ice Puddle. Then to a giant freeze ball. Slide kick to an Aerial Uppercut. Chibi Moon almost out of the fight here. And a slide kick to finish her off. <laughs> Damn, man. Wins. Blossom and Omega Zero are just ripping every team apart so far. Blossom got a hell of a partner there. Let's see, Blossom starts off with a freeze on Chibi Moon who blocks. Omega Zero firing off blue beams and sword beams. And then a sword uppercut to Chibi Moon. Blossom setting up a nice puddle on board Diddy. Blossom charging in there. And now Blossom going maximum on both Diddy and Chibi Moon as Omega Zero spams his blue laser shower attack. And then Blossom gets an electric grab to Chibi Moon followed by a big uppercut. And Diddy Kong trips on the ice puddle as Omega Zero misses his beam saber slashes. Diddy Kong taken out of the fight. Blossom firing off a big, big eye beam, putting Chibi Moon down for the count. Good God, man. Blossom and Omega Zero are just tearing through everyone at the moment. Nobody screws with this fiery little redhead. <laughs> Alrighty, folks. Match number four goes to Blossom and Omega Zero. Now let's see who they will fight in match number five. Man, oh man. Blossom and Omega Zero just dominating like no other. Alrighty, let's see which team they will fight now. Ooh, we got Sakura and a partner. And we'll find out who her partner is in a moment. Let's go back to the Universal Arena. Hope you guys enjoy match number five. Let's do it. Ooh, Sakura and Wonder Woman. Alright, let's see if Blossom and Omega Zero could do it again. So far, they have, they have won four matches straight. Now see Blossom tries to start off with a freeze on Sakura. Ice Puddle tripping her up. Blossom misses the aerial uppercut. Ice Puddle and then a roundhouse on Sakura knocking her down. 
Blossom trips her up in the ice puddle. Wonder Woman tries to go for a suplex on Blossom, but misses the grab. And Omega Zero firing off some blue energy stuff. This is his uh, big beam saver attack. Fires off more giant beams and sword beams. Blossom gets knocked down. Giant multi hit boomerang bow to Wonder Woman and Sakura. Wonder Woman ends up grabbing Blossom and then gets a spinning throw on her. Blossom sets up an ice puddle as Wonder Woman tries to do a foot kick. Blossom finishes off Wonder Woman with an uppercut. Blossom trips up Sakura on the ice puddle. Omega Zero getting in there with his beam saber. Knocking Sakura senseless. Takes her down. Blossom wins. And Blossom and Omega Zero continue their winning streak. All right, round two. Let's see what happens in this one. Let's see, Blossom starts off in a free Sakura blocks. Omega Zero jumping in with multiple sword beams. And Blossom trying to catch Wonder Woman. Lands a super fist on her. Now Sakura trying to block Omega Zero's beam shots. And then Omega Zero misses the sword combo on Sakura, who turns up in the ice puddle. Wonder Woman grabs Blossom and suplexes her. Now Sakura throws off some ninja darts as Omega Zero starts raining down giant boulders to sword up against the Wonder Woman. And then Blossom lands a super fist on Wonder Woman as Omega Zero rains more boulders down. And now starts attacking Sakura in the corner with beam saber top. Blossom doing jumping hand beams and sweep kicks. And now Omega Zero doing a giant blue laser light aura. And then a giant multi-hit boomerang bow from Blossom and an already played jumping eye beam. Then a slide kick to an aerial uppercut. Omega Zero and Blossom just dominating poor Sakura in the corner. Sakura can't seem to mount any kind of comeback and Blossom finishes her off. Damn. Blossom and Omega Zero continue the winning streak. Piece of cake. <laughs> it sure seems like it. Alrighty, folks. Onward to match number six. Man, Blossom and Omega Zero still dominating. All right, let's see who they get in team. Let's see who they get for team number six. Hopefully, it'll be a much tougher one. Let's see. Oh, Boss Saget, and ooh, I can't wait to see who his partner is. And sorry for that wind puff. Let me move the mic away a little bit. Uh, kind of annoying. Anyways, let's see. Back to the same stage. I love the Universal Arena stage. So don't mind me, folks. Anyways, here we go with match number six. Ooh, we got Boss Saget and Skeletor. That's an evil combo there. Alright, let's see how Blossom does against Skeletor and Boss Saget. Along with Omega Zero here. Alrighty, Blossom starts off with a freeze on Boss Saget, then a freeze to Skeletor, Ice Puddle, then Blossom does a jumping hand beam. Hardy Clay right to Boss Saget into a freeze close to a roundhouse. And now it looks like Omega Zero jumping in, doing some close combat fighting with the Beam Saber. And now Skeletor and Boss Saget stuck in the corner. Omega Zero keeping a pin there with his blue laser shower. Blossom tacks on an aerial uppercut, sets up a giant ice ball. Maximum Blossom to both Skeletor and Boss Saget. And Omega Zero tacking on his blue laser shower attack. Skeletor trips on the ice puddle. Boss Saget taken out of the fight. Skeletor blocks Blossom's eye beam. But Omega Zero takes him out with the Beam Saber. And Blossom and Omega Zero just continue to impress. Let's see if Skeletor and Boss Saget could do something here. Let's see, Blossom sets up a nice puddle and then a big Tiger Beam right into Blossom's face. Omega Zero charges in with a Beam Saber uppercut. Giant multi-hit boomerang going from behind. Let's see, Blossom sets up a nice puddle as Omega Zero just charges right in. And then an already played right to Skeletor to an aerial fist, freezes him up, and then freezes him up in Ice Cold Roundhouse. And now Blossom charges up a big eye beam. Boss Saget gets juggled and dies in it. Then an already played and Skeletor gets grounded by Omega Zero. Man, I cannot believe it. Six matches in a row, Blossom and Omega Zero have torn it up. Nobody screws with this fiery little redhead. <laughs> yeah, my god. Alrighty, folks, now it's onward to match number seven, I think. God, I can't even remember. I think it's match number seven. Yeah, here we go. And now Blossom and Omega Zero continue through this gauntlet. Good god almighty. Alrighty, let's see how Blossom and Omega Zero do against this next team for match number seven. Let's see, we got... Ooh, we got Kai teaming up with someone. We'll find out who his partner is in a minute. And this battle will take place on Universal Arena. Hope you guys enjoy. Ooh, we got Naruto and Kai. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see how Blossom and Omega Zero do against Naruto and Kai. Okay, Blossom starts off in a freeze on Naruto. Omega Zero dashing around. Naruto and Guy get handy by Blossom. Only play right to Naruto. Blossom sets up an ice puddle as Guy trips up on it. And Naruto doing a teleporting act, trying to hit Omega Zero. And let's see Blossom sets up an ice puddle on Naruto. Sweet kick knocking him down. Blossom gets an uppercut. Guy bouncing around like a ping pong ball. And then Blossom lands a super fist on Naruto. Omega Zero spamming beam attacks and sword beam from afar. Then summons his blue light shower. And then Blossom sets up an ice clone slide into an aerial uppercut on Guy. Blossom sets up a nice puddle on Naruto. Naruto and Guy stuck in the corners. 
Blossom and Omega Zero lay into him. Naruto trying to do his teleporting decoy act. Knocks Blossom down. And Blossom battles back with a giant multi-hit boomerang bow as Naruto gets knocked down. Turns another decoy attack. Omega Zero summoning his blue laser aura. And Omega Zero misses the beam saber uppercut. Blossom gets a slide kick off on Naruto. Ice puddle then a hand beam knocking Naruto down. And Omega Zero attacks him from behind with a beam saber uppercut. Blossom wins. And Blossom and Omega Zero just still domi a very dominant force. Only two more teams to go, and this gauntlet's over. Let's see, Blossom leaps over, Naruto freezes up with the ice puddle and trips him up. Then a super fist, and Guy gets knocked down by Omega Zero. Omega Zero just charging in as Guy trips up on the ice puddle. Blossom with the aerial uppercut. And let's see, Blossom charges up, lands a super fist on Guy. Omega Zero turns his attention to Naruto. Naruto tries for a dash energy fist. Omega Zero gets a beam saber uppercut. Let's see, Blossom trying to spam the Arctic Blades. And it looks like Guy's already taken out of the fight as Naruto tries his decoy attack. Let's see, Omega Zero misses his Beam Saber shot. Blossom getting knocked down as Omega Zero charges up his blue laser shower aura. Then an Arctic Blade right to the heart and then into one of Blossom's laser clones. Omega Zero raining down some rocks on Naruto. Naruto sandwiched between Blossom and Omega Zero's attacks. And no chance for the Ninja Boy. And Blossom and Omega Zero win once more. Piece of cake. <laughs> Alrighty, folks, it's onward to match number eight. I believe this is match number eight. I could be wrong. I don't know. It's kind of hard to keep track with all the action, but... Yeah, I think we're going to do two more battles, so here we go. Two more random teams. Let's see who Blossom and Omega Zero get next. And they will get... Ooh, we got Meta Knight teaming up with someone. Let's see who his partner is. Same stage as normal. Here we go with match number eight, folks. Ooh! Looks like we got Keiza and Meta Knight. Let's see how Blossom and Omega Zero do against Meta Knight and Keiza. Ready! <laughs> got two mess men. Here we go. Let's see if Blossom and Omega Zero can keep their momentum going. Blossom freezes Keiza. And now Omega Zero getting in with his Beam Saber on Meta Knight. And then Blossom gets an aerial fist off on Keiza. And then Keiza blocks Blossom's slide kick. And then Keiza tries to go at Omega Zero with his Beam Saber shot. Blossom guns Meta Knight and lobs him across the stage. Then a slide kick to Aerial Leprechaun on Keiza. Then Blossom turns around and lands a super fist on Meta Knight. Omega Zero doing a boulder summon on Keiza, slamming him with those giant rocks. And Blossom offs him with an Aerial Leprechaun. And then Omega Zero starts slashing Meta Knight as Blossom gets a slide kick to an Aerial Leprechaun, the Bat Boy. Blossom. Yeah. And Blossom and Omega Zero lie waste of Meta Knight and Keiza pretty easily. Alright, round two. Let's see, Blossom starts off with a freeze on Meta Knight, tries to freeze again in the ice backfire. Omega Zero getting in the corner on Meta Knight and Keiza. And then Keiza gets a super fist from Blossom. And to an I beam cancel on both Meta Knight and him. And now Omega Zero trying to heal up his energy with this blue light aura. And then Blossom gets an Arctic Blade on Keiza, freezes up with the Ice Clone. Then she turns her attention on Meta Knight, trying to hand-beam him. Then a Psychic Airy Leprechaun bolt volleying both guys. And now Keiza battling back with a Sword Beam combo on Blossom. And then Blossom gets in there with an Electric Grab, but Meta Knight blocks. And then Omega Zero charges up with his Blue Laser Shower again. Then a Psychic Airy Leprechaun to both Keiza and Meta Knight. And both of them go down pretty quickly. And Blossom and Omega Zero just still continue their clean sweep. Nobody screws with this fiery little redhead. Yes, Blossom, we know. <laughs> you won again. <laughs> Alrighty, folks, now the final match is coming up of this uh, 1,000 special gauntlet, random character gauntlet. Anyways, let's see who Blossom and Omega Zero will get for their final opponents. Hopefully, it'll be a very tough pair. Let's see. And who will we draw now? We got Lara Croft and a partner of her choosing. Let's find out who it is. Let's go to the Universal Arena and let's see who their final opponent... Ooh, Galactus! Galactus and Lara Croft, oh boy. I don't know how Blossom and Omega Zero will do against Galactus and Lara Croft, but this should be interesting. Alright, let's see how this final tag match plays out, folks, of this random tag character's gauntlet. Blossom starts off with a slide and kick, but this is as Galactus is high up in the air. And now Omega Zero starts slashing into Lara Croft as Blossom sets up an ice puddle. And a big fist missing Blossom. Blossom gets a slide kick to an aerial uppercut on Lara Croft, and then a giant eye beam from Galactus, knocking Blossom senseless, that Blossom does Lara Croft and throws her. Let's see Omega Zero missing his beam saber slashes, and oh boy, Blossom getting decked by Galactus' beam attacks, and now Omega Zero lying in the Lara Croft in the corner. Blossom misses the aerial uppercut, and she gets caught by a giant eye beam from Galactus. Now Blossom going maximum, but gets knocked out of it by a corkscrew beam, and then Blossom gets flame royal by a... A fire summon, a fire woman summon, and Lara Croft and Blossom take it out of the fight. Now it's down to Omega Zero and Galactus. 
I wonder which one of these two are going to win. Let's see, both of these characters are in the same class, so this should be a very intense fight. Let's see, Omega Zero starts with his Beat Saber slashes, and then gets a blue light shot, light shower on Galactus. And then Omega Zero using his uh, blue light shower to heal his health as he continues to slash it. Galactus he battles back with a giant red beam. Now let's see, Omega Zero gets hit by all of Galactus' summit. And now Omega Zero raining down some boulders. And let's see, Miss barely dodges Galactus' fist. And Omega Zero gets a beam saber up and cut to Galactus' face and takes him down. And Omega Zero wins it for him and Blossom. Alright, round two. Alright, let's see how the round two plays out. Let's see, Blossom starts off with the maximum Blossom on Lara Croft. I don't know if it's getting Galactus at all, but Blossom punishes Lara with the big uppercut. And then Omega Zero starts slamming Galactus with his blue light shower. And then Blossom sets up a nice bar on Lara Croft and tries a pitfall trap. And then Blossom using a level 3 breath attack, cross breath attack on Galactus surrounding him. And now Lara Croft trips up on the ice puddle as Omega Zero heals up. Blossom gets a strike and carry uppercut. And now Omega Zero carves into Lara Croft in the corner. And Lara Croft getting pounded by the blue light shower of Omega Zero. Blossom shooting off more freeze blast, ice puddle, Lara Croft blocking in the corner. Then a giant multi hit boomerang bow right into Omega Zero's beam saber as Lara Croft turns for a slide kick. Blossom dude does a giant laser, Lara Croft blocks, blocks the Arctic Blade. Lara Croft trying to block every attack just as she gets frozen. Slide kick aerial uppercut. Lara Croft on her last legs here as Omega Zero slashes the crap out of her in the corner, taking her out. And there you have it, folks. Oh my god. That was a crazy random 1000 encounter. Good god. Another day saved. Better luck next time, sucker. Alrighty, folks. Hope you guys enjoyed Random Musion Battle 1000 with the random tag team character Gauntlet. I think there was like 10 different teams, and Blossom and Omega Zero pretty much cleaned them all up. <laughs> Blossom really got lucky with the draw of her partner. Good god. Anyways, folks, stay tuned for Musion Battle 1001 coming soon. Later, all.